Shalom, Kohalo Ila, Yahweh, Bashim, Yabashai, Bashim, Kakadash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and the singing on told black around the world. May Yahweh, Bashim, Yabashai, continue to protect and guide our steps throughout these turbulent times. It's your brother Nadal, I'll connect you with another one. And today's lesson is Shall Come to Pass. Once again, Shall Come to Pass. That's right, I'm talking about these prophecies that's written throughout the scriptures. Okay, mainly one of the Israelites, the remnant. Okay, coming back into the fold. Okay, and ultimately delivered at Yahweh Shah's second coming. We're going to get the definition of pass to go by something to cross over. Man, to pass, to step, walk past. To go on to move forward. That's right, and these prophecies are moving forward by spirit and power of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah. Okay. And by the mouth of the prophets, they are letting uh these these signs known, okay. Or these tokens known to the uh, hopeful let and to the rest of the world, okay. All right, uh to go through an examination successfully. All right. Um, got down here. All right. Uh, pass. Go across or through. Make laws, bills, etc., or bring to effect by legislation. Pass by. Place hands into or custody of. That's right, and ultimately, we are placing the hands of Yahweh Bashim Yahushua, that hope for number, that remnant, those that's going to remain, okay, and ultimately deliver a Yahushua's second coming. All right, stretch out over a distance, space, time, or scope, run or stand between two points or beyond a certain point. Pass, come to pass, happen. That's right, and this was what's going to happen. Those remnant, okay. He let, okay, those in the vessels fed for mercy are going to uh, be delivered, okay, and ultimately rounded up and delivered, okay, by this word, the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the scriptures, okay. I'm going to start off in Isaiah 10 and verse 20. Isaiah chapter 10. And verse 20. Come, and it shall come to pass. That's right, these prophecies come to pass in that day that the remnant, those that remain, the elect of Israel, okay, it's made to my northern uh, kingdom, and such are escaped of the house of Jacob, the southern kingdom. Shall I no more again stay upon him that smoke or beat them, these damn Edomites, okay? And also these other heat nations that have some different captivities, okay? But shall stay upon the Lord, Yahweh, the Holy One of Israel, in truth. The Holy One of Israel is to my Yahweh Shah. That's right. And the uh, hopeful let is going to stay over the old, that, uh, that covering. Ultimately, it's true, okay? Because this is that secret place. Okay, from the discretion that's coming to pass. Alright. Verse 21, the remnant. Okay, the elect shall return, even the remnant of Jacob, to the mighty power. That's right. Oh uh, no, Yahweh Shah is going to gather his elect from the four corners of the earth. Okay. Because he says he delivers. For though, okay, verse 22, for though thy people Israel be as the sand of the sea, because the Israelites is in normal, where uh, in every, we've been scattered amongst all nations upon the earth, okay, and we also have confusion of face of uh, Israelites out there, our brothers and sisters, okay, and if your spirit resonates with it's true, and your sea line goes back to Abraham, Isaac, or Jacob, you're in fact an Israelite, okay. The consumption decree shall overflow with righteousness. That's right. And ultimately, you know what I'm saying? That's that uh, that's the king is going to rule be ruled in righteousness. Ultimately. On the Yahweh Shah. Okay. Get a couple backup scriptures. 
Okay. Isaiah 1 and 9. Except the Lord, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shah of hosts, the armies had left unto a very small remnant, that's the elect, we should have been at Sodom, and we should have been like unto the war. That's right, because he destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah, okay, in the past. And uh, modern day Sodom and Gomorrah, uh, modern day Sodom is America, because they pushed that alphabet agenda upon the masses of the world. Okay, plus Esau, he's a natural born sodomite. So, oh uh, no, they're gonna be destroyed. Okay, but first we gotta get them thousand years up out you. Okay, and then you're also gonna be exterminated. But would I win eighteen all day? I can't wait. All right, Isaiah. Chapter 37, verse 31. And the remnant, those that remain in the escape of the house of Judah, that's the uh, southern kingdom, shall again take root downward, and it's true, and bear fruit upward. Okay. By uh, confessing the names of Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, and these prophecies. And what's asked of you, okay, rehearsing righteous acts, those that you can't keep, okay, and doing what's pleasing to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, okay. Verse 32, for out of Jerusalem shall go forth a remedy. It's the northern kingdom, and they that escape out of Zion, it's talking about the elect memorial, the zeal of the Lord Yahweh by Shemiah of Shah, of hosts, of armies shall do this. That's right, because all these are the words of Yahweh by Shemiah of Shah. That's what he wants to come to pass. And all you other nations are not invited. Okay, you were made to be hand servants and handmaids. Okay. All right, let's see what we got. We got. Uh, we got Hosea 14 3. For sure. Should not say that there's another of uh, these Assyrians or Esau, these Edomites, so called white people. We will not ride upon the horses. Neither. Will we say any more to the work of our hands? Ye are our gods, for in thee the fathers find mercy, and their fathers, that's to the elect, remain the Israelites, okay? Because we, uh, we fell away from our heritage, we didn't know who we were, okay? And ultimately, you know what I'm saying, we were given to the hands of our enemies, okay? For our punishment, ultimately. All right, Isaiah chapter 48, verses 1 and 2. Hear ye this, O house of Jacob, the Israelites, which are called by the name Israel, and are come forth out of the waters of Judah. Okay, the king, the king, the forefathers, our forefathers, okay. Which swear by the name of Yahweh, Yahweh, and make mention of the power of Israel, but not in truth, nor in righteousness. Okay, verse 2, for they call themselves of a holy city and state themselves upon the Most High Yahweh, power of Israel, the Lord Yahweh Shem Host is his name. That's right. We're going to stay, okay, our Ratazah, he keep his Holy Spirit upon us to continue the truth and endure to the end, okay? Because the elect must be saved there out of it, okay? Jeremiah 30 and 7, it takes the struggle ultimately. Okay, we're gonna have the ultimate faith in Yahweh Shah, knowing he's going to or has appointed certain angels to protect you and that he's going to deliver you at this said time. Okay, when Yahweh gives him the green light. Okay, so it's gonna end this lesson. I'm gonna end up by saying Shalom, Quan Yasarala, Wah Bakusha, Bakusha, Bakusha. Yah about some Yah Masha. Kawama Yah Bala Yah Nawa Shema Elahin Yah Bawa Malaza Yah Hain Wah Baksha 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 Yah about some Yah Masha. Shalak Me Pardon Me Wamiyum Wah Baksha Wah Baal 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 Shalom.